Hi guys, Miss P here. It's another week and we are back at um, chapter reviews for my book called Maneuvering Teenage Life. Thank you so much for watching. Um, why are we doing these videos? We're doing these videos because we want to learn. We don't know everything. Information is knowledge. Information is power. Um, so we are arming ourselves um, for the parents that are watching so that they can be better parents similarly with teenagers so that they can make better decisions for your life we're connecting them to resources connecting them to information that will make them better so i wrote this book with an idea to help teenagers um to to make better decisions with their lives so that they can succeed because teenagers are important and they are the future of south africa so we are relying on them to be the next presidents. We are relying on them to be economists. We are really relying on them to change the status quo of South Africa and the world at large. So we're doing it chapter by chapter for those parents who don't have a book. If you want to order a book, um, there's a link at the bottom where you can order online and we ship it to you within three days of ordering. The book itself is only 280. It is a very useful tool for your teenagers. So... I'm yourself with this and you'll thank me one day. Okay, so which chapter are we um, reviewing today? We are reviewing a chapter called How to Stop Being Envious of Other People because it happens to the most of us, not just me as a parent, but also just people in general. You know, when you see other people succeeding and you not, it becomes very, very easy to, to stop focusing on your lane and keeping to your lane and then you start um you know looking at other people and be like ah oh, but they're winning then um faster than me one thing that I, I can share with you is that um every dog has its day there's that saying your day will come but the important thing is to you know keep at your your craft keep at um believing that your dream is va is valid that your day is going to come because it is going to come but also you need to put in strategies to help you succeed the people that are succeeding are not succeeding by mistake yeah some people are succeeding by luck but there's also hard work to everything so every success that you're going to have right but what we don't want is for you to be focused on looking at other people and be like oh they're winning or oh, they're getting this or oh, they uh, ahead of you and that happens we all are not going to win at the same time i mean i know a lot of my peers that i that i went to university with peers that i went to school with are far ahead of me but also there's people that i'm far ahead of um and 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 like I was also last at some point in my life, um, not that I'm number one now, but I am focusing on my lane, focusing on what God has uh, brought me here. I'm focusing on my journey and where I am, perfecting and learning and growing my skills, um, but just focusing in my space. So being envious of other people is also not going to help you because it will just derail you um, and you'll feel depressed and unhappy and you'll be blaming God as if... Um, He's bringing those things upon you and it's not true but we all have tens um but also there's certain things we can do to accelerate our growth to accelerate our success uh, and choices that we can make so that we can be better people hence again we have these videos where we are i'm speaking to teenagers and saying be careful of the choices that you're making today because they are definitely going to affect you later in life sometimes we think when we become adults it's like oh my god life just happened to me life doesn't happen to you the teen the 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 decisions that you made in your life previously from a young age up until where you are today are results of who you become right i always say sometimes you find people that are working in um, um not that i'm looking up down upon them but um let's just say sometimes you find people working in careers that they don't want to be uh, doing um that are not paying that are not fulfilling um and then it looks like they have not made it in life and they're sad and they're angry and sometimes it's only because they didn't sit enough to um to to work on their craft so the idea of having this channel or me coming on to you is to plead on you to say the decisions that you're making today the choices that you're choosing today will be um will be very crucial for your future so just be careful including the friends everything that you that you're doing so i'm going to today we are reviewing a chapter called how to stop being envious of other people so sometimes it's not even a way that you're envious of people so how do you switch yourself on when here's the thing 
if you don't know that you're doing something wrong, you'll never know how to stop it, right? So this chapter makes you aware that even if it's your friend, your very best friend, that is probably succeeding or passing in a test and whatnot. Instead of being envious, you could actually channel that and say, my friend, I know you're good at this. Can we spend time? Um, teach me, you know, these methods. How do you do it? How is it that you are passing the test? How is it that you are understanding? Help me to understand, you know, because jealousy is not going to help you with anything. But you could take that envy, not even envy, but more look at them and be like, oh, my friend is succeeding. I want to be more like them. What can I do to, to, to learn from them? Never be afraid to speak to people and say, look, um, I want, I want to be like you. I want to do better. I'm not doing great because most of the time, because of our pride, um, and we, we are scared to put ourselves out there. Then we, we stay in our corner, um, in our corner of jealousy, which doesn't help us, but makes, make us even more angry and, and guess what? We don't um, we don't even succeed. So here's some of the um, topics within this chapter. Um, first, you need to figure out why you're envious of whoever you're envious with. Can't fix a problem if you don't know what the problem is. Focus on the good, right? Um, look at the situation and decide. What is good? I mean, if you're an envious of someone, first you must realize that there's clearly something good that someone is doing right, right? Let's focus on the, on that good that that person is doing. Don't turn it around and make it seem like it's a bad thing to do. Okay, compare less. Oh my goodness, I cannot stress this enough. We are all here for a reason. I always talk about a seed that we're given. Our seed is enough for us. We don't need to be looking at Jablani and looking at Pinky and what Pinky is good at. You need to be focusing on you and yourself. Okay, be happy for other people, right? You gotta be happy for other people. You gotta celebrate their wins because when you celebrate other people, life starts happening to you, to good things starts happening to you, to appreciate them. You know, tell them that you know what, you're doing great. Don't be like that um angry Mary, you know. Appreciate yourself more. Yeah, because sometimes, because other people are winning, you start feeling sorry for yourself, you start blaming yourself, and all of that. No, we need to get out of that pity party and focus on appreciating ourselves with the little steps and where we are at that particular time in our lives. Um, ah, give what you'd want from others. If you want to, someone to teach you math and you're good at science, as an example, go teach someone else science, you know. So that you can get someone else. You know, life is all about attraction. It's a give and take. You know, you can't get what you don't give. So be kind so that some people can be kind to you too. Okay. Also avoid envious people yourself. If someone is jealous of you and you can feel the, their energy that they are not buying into your story. They're not believing in your dream. They just don't like your success. Stay away from them. Okay, and of course, there's some notes here at the end of the chapter that you would have done here on this particular topic. And then you would sign it, declare it, and um, and win. Um, yeah, it's a, it's a very good chapter. I hope you get yourself a copy, a copy, a copy, a copy of the book. Um, yeah, I'll leave the link below and you can order yourself a book. And be smarter and wiser. Love you guys. Bye.